chicken is star. I'm not sure what to do with it. Someone's at the door. One minute. Oh my God, guys. Look who it is. Your chicken coach. You're right on time. Yes. I'm not sure what to do with you. Then. Again, what's yes. up with that? Oh my God, I have people to feed. Right. Tomorrow is my dinner and I'm just not sure what to do. Calm down. As okay. easy as one, two, three. Maybe. Right. So what you want to do, I like to brine mine. Mm -hmm. You add some flavor to it. And what you also do is you're adding some moisture. Because roasting is a long process, so when you add that moisture now to it, mm -hmm. so when it's roasting, it's not going to be dry. First okay. off. Then second, no, it's seasoning. Right. With whatever seasoning you like, and third, in the oven, and that's it. All right. So we're going to do this right now. All okay, right. Yes. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. All right, so now we got our chicken removed from the package, and it's already washed. Right. So all you need to do now is, we're still in step one. Okay. So you want to grab a pan from over there. So for brining now, you so can... I can put the chicken yes. in? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Whatever flavor you want. So okay. I'm doing a jerk roast. Mm -hmm. So in this, I got some allspice, right. pimento, of course, some mm -hmm. onion, I got some garlic, a little jerk seasoning in there. Mm -hmm. So that's the flavor that the chicken is gonna have. All right. So, so you wanna get this boiling, you know, right, hold on. just extract the flavors from it. Like 10, 15 minutes, okay. and let it cool before you add it to your chicken. All right, so we're so, gonna leave this in the brine for how long? About 24 hours. 23. So you're right on time, because my dinner is tomorrow. Okay. All right, yeah, so we're good. So we got lots of time. And if you're short on time, you can always do like 12 hours. Okay, awesome. Yeah. So I put this in the refrigerator. In the refrigerator. Do I cover it? You can cover it. So we're gonna wrap this. Okay. And then in the refrigerator for 24 hours, you'll see me back. So now, look at this. It's very nice. You can smell it, right? Mm-hmm. The tomatoes and yes. the thyme and so the onions. So you can absorb all of that already. Very so what nice. we need to do now is rinse this. Okay. Take all the excess salt from it so it oh, doesn't brown okay. too quickly. So okay. let's go and do that. Then we're going to get back and we're going to season and inside the oven. Sounds good. All right. Okay, so we have now washed off yes. the brine, mm -hmm. but I have a question. Sure. Why would we wash off the brine? Doesn't the brine have all your seasoning and goodness that you need for the chicken? Yes, that's a good question. So what I did earlier is I used lots of salt. Mm -hmm. in it. Okay. So this, the purpose of the brine already complete because I want that for the inside of the chicken. So okay. the chicken already absorbed all of that. So when you rinse it, you're taking up all the excess salt from the outside. Oh, okay, gotcha. So you can add your own flavor of seasoning now. So I'm using some jerk season, some dry jerk seasoning here with some salt and pepper. So when you, okay, so so when you season your chicken, just use whatever seasoning you like. So what okay. it's gonna do now is while it's roasting, mm -hmm. it's adding some moisture oh. to it. So you end up with a nice moist roast. Okay, yeah. and you can get your stuff to buy already in the supermarket. Oh yeah, or you can make your own with okay. some chicken bone. And the good thing with these, they come with a little chicken neck inside and stuff. You can use that to make a little stock. So we're ready for the oven? Yeah, we're ready for the oven. So we're gonna do this for at 350 mm -hmm. for like one hour, maybe an hour and a half. It depends on the size of your chicken okay. as well. So like for this one, I can say one hour and 15 minutes. Plus, you also need to baste it while it's cooking. So like every 20 minutes, mm -hmm. you from the juice from here, mm -hmm. you pour it back on the chicken. So you're adding some more flavor to the chicken, okay. crispiness and all the good things Them Chicken goes in. It's smelling so, so good. good. And this has been open for like an hour, right? Mm -hmm. And it's also at a temperature at 165. Oh. Mm. Delicious. Yes. Oh my god, and it's right on time yeah. too because my family is almost here. And I guess I can stay for dinner, right? Well, you don't live here. <laughs> <laughs> but I do thank you and I do appreciate it. This was so much fun. Anytime you can call me. I will.